What's going on? It's Casey. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I want to talk about audio editing tips that I use when I'm mixing beats, mixing with vocals, just working with audio. So I'm just going to show you a few tricks that can speed up your workflow, progress and get to the next level. Let's jump in. So I've got this mix here for an artist who's about to release his first single. There should be a link in the description below. Please check it out, support him. And yeah, and just watch him, watch him grow as he's on his journey. So Marquee tool is my favorite tool. I use that all the time for cutting and splicing. A lot of people like to use the scissor tool. How I've set mine up is I've got the pointer tool as the main, and then the second tool is my Marquee tool. So all I need to do is press command and my Marquee tool is there ready to go. Another thing I like about the Marquee tool is when you press command, and click it will leave like a little line where the playhead's gonna start from here's an example so yeah that's the marquee tool use it as a playhead start young nigga rise up trying to shoot me me up put an it's especially good as well when you're trying to tame some S's. So let's just find the S. So that's an S, that's a definite S because it's all bunched up and compressed and yeah, let's just hit it quickly. So we can go in. I like that with the marquee tool. Click on it. Pull it down with again. She my rider, she gonna tear that. Okay, there's another S in there as well. But you don't want to pull the S's down too far because you make the artist sound like they've got a lisp. Reason, she my rider, she gonna tear that kid. Reason, she my rider, she gonna tear that kid. Young nigga rise up and blaze. So that's my marquee tool. The other thing is clip gain i spoke about it in one of my other videos and how important it is how it is one of those things that i wish i knew when i first started mixing and making beats so as you can see some of the vocal parts are quite loud so what i do is use my marquee tool cut a bit go to the gain you can pull the gain you can pull that section out as well if you if it makes it easier for you and then you can just use that to pull the gain down amazing if you don't want to do that, you can use a game plugin, which I'm using here. If you're watching my older videos, you would have seen I, I always used to use Vumped as my first plugin, but now just Logic Stock plugin, which is the game plugin, it's cool, does the job. So yeah, that's just a short video to show you some quick tips and tricks that you can use when you're editing your vocals or working with audio. Yeah, I hope this has helped. If it has, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, so you get notified anytime I put up a new video. And make sure you hit me up on Instagram as well. I'm always dropping tips and tricks and little stuff that's going on behind the scenes or in this studio. So yeah, hit me up. Let's connect. Thank you for watching.